Bonjour mes amis. Welcome to my channel, The French Station, the right stop for learning French. My name is Vignesh, your teacher and friend. I'm very thrilled to help you on your French learning journey and to make the language fun and easy for you. In this video, let's move ahead with the fifth lesson. We will be learning the uh, ORI verb FAIR. It's a new verb. We will be learning its conjugation and we will also cover certain expressions using the verb fair. So the verb fair means to do or to make. Uh, it is given here that the French verb fair has many meanings. It's also used to talk about weather and sports. We, we will be learning expressions uh, in a short while. So you will see that this verb fair is uh, also used to talk about weather. Uh, expressions related to weather and sports also. Uh, being an RE verb, uh, you can see that the conjugation is irregular. It doesn't have a uh, pattern that we uh, follow like ER verbs or regular IR verbs. So you need to memorize the conjugation. The conjugation goes like this. The infinitive form is fair. Fair is to do or to make. In the je form, we say uh, je fais. In fact, in all these uh, forms, we say je, tu, il, elle, fait. Fait is the pronunciation. But for the il, elle forms, the spelling is F-A-I-T. For je and tu, it is F-A-I-S. But the pronunciation is the same. So it means I do or I make, uh, I am doing or I am making, you do. You're doing, you make, or you're making. That's how the translation is. So, je, tu, il, elle, fait. For the new form, we say, nous faisons. We make, or we do, we are making, or we are doing. Then in the vu form, you can see that it doesn't end in the letters E, Z. Instead, it ends in E, S. So, in the vu form, it is vu fait, vu fait. You make or you're making, you do or you're doing. And then in the ILS and ELLES forms, we say, il, elle, font. Il font, elle font. They do or they are doing, they make or they are making. So this is how the verb fair is conjugated. Now let's move ahead with expression avec fair. Certain expressions using the verb fair. So, over here we have, elle fait un gâteau. She makes a cake. So, the expression is, faire, F-A-I-R-E, faire un gâteau. Faire un gâteau means to make or uh, to bake a cake. So, if you, for example, if you say, je fais un gâteau, it means I am making a cake. If you say, vous faites un gâteau, it means you are making a cake. All right. The second one is Elfe du ski. She is skiing. In English, we say uh, he is skiing, she is skiing. But in French, we need to say Fe du ski. So the expression is Fer du ski. For example, if you say uh, Je fais, je fais du ski, it means I am skiing. The third one. Elfe say the war. She does her homework. The word the war means homework. So if you say, for example, elle font leur the war, it means they do their homework. The word leur, you will learn more about it in the coming lessons. It means their, T H E I R. So they are doing their homework. For example, if you say, Je fais me the war. M E S the war. It means I am doing my homework. So here it, this sentence means she is doing her homework. Then the next expression, il fait jour. Uh, il fait jour is nothing but it is a day. Over here, il fait doesn't translate to he does or he makes. But it's a fixed expression. Il fait jour means it is day. Il fait nuit means it is night. And then the next expression. Il fait chaud. It is hot or warm. 
il fait froid it is cold then we have elle fait une promenade so she is taking a walk in english we say she is taking a walk but in french we need to use the expression faire une promenade for example if you say uh, nous faisons une promenade it means we are taking a walk or we are going for a walk so the sentence means she goes for a walk then here we have some note points when you say il fait froid it means it is cold but if you say il a froid if you use the verb avoir it means he is feeling cold all right so there's a difference uh, when we say il fait froid it talks about the weather the weather is cold but when you say il a froid it means he is feeling cold probably he has a fever or something like that then uh, same thing goes for il fait chaud it means it is hot or the weather is hot but when you say il a chaud it means he is feeling hot and then the question quel temps fait il when you ask someone il fait quel temps or quel temps fait il it means how is the weather or what is the weather like Thank you so much for watching the video. Please subscribe to my channel, The French Station, to get notified on the upcoming videos. Like it and share it with your friends as well. Until then, abhiyanto. See you soon.